A vest made by a group of teens could actually help people who are visually impaired. Yeah, Fox 13 tech reporter Jordan Hogan joins us live this morning with more on how what's called the ActiVest has the potential to change lives. Good morning, Jordan. Good morning, Amy and John. Yes, yeah, so the ActiVest right now is just a prototype, but what it's able to do is very impressive. In fact, it's been able to help someone who's visually impaired go skiing without much help. There are a variety of outdoor activities people can do to stay active, but it's not always easy for everyone. So a group of students at Juan Diego Catholic High School took this thought and applied it to making something that could help people who are visually impaired. We came up with a vest that basically helps them become more active. The active vest uses three ultrasonic sensors and vibration motors to guide people who are visually impaired around objects. Two of the sensors are on the front of the vest and one of them is on the back. These ultrasonic sensors send out waves and they calculate the distance between the wearer and the object. How often the vibrations happen depends on how far away the wearer is from a person or object. The more often they vibrate, the closer the user is to an object. The further away they are, the less it vibrates. We actually tested this with one of my teammates and she was walking towards a pole and she was able to stop in time like this close from the pole and it's amazing how quick that feedback worked. The students also tested the activist with a woman who has been blind since birth. She was able to go skiing with it which I think is amazing. Activist won the $10,000 grand prize at the 2021 High School Utah Entrepreneur Challenge. Now the team plans to use that money to make a second prototype. People who've been testing the activist said it's harder to tell whether an object is stationary or coming towards them. They hope using Doppler sensors, stronger vibration motors and more complex programming can help with that. Definitely hoping it would be something that would change people's lives. So the ActiVest team, they actually want to put the uh, circuitry and everything that you saw on the inside of the vest into some detachable panels so they can be swapped out onto other modified clothing. Uh, so, you know, things like jackets and sweaters and stuff like that, John and Amy. Wow. Is this expensive technology, Jordan? So it's actually relatively inexpensive, John and Amy. So they're using these uh, very small computer cards that can be easily programmed using a 9-volt battery. So it's, it's definitely uh, something that they've invested in, but nothing that's, you know, thousands of dollars. Wow, so impressive. Congratulations to those students and hopefully improving lives out there. Pretty remarkable.